chasing the police every single day. Say hi, Andy. I'm recording you. I got you. Yes, they are. You know what's really criminal? What's that? Those knee-high socks. I know, but that's what the brown shirts wore. <laughs> Internal Affairs Internal Investigation IA 2022-015 Deputy Nicole Kowalski No. 3630 Investigator, Sergeant Nikki Wagner Integrity, Praces Rinalis 11 Trust Charlotte County Sheriff's Office Summary On March 10, 2022 at approximately 2 a.m. Lt. Richard McDonald spoke with Northport Police Department, Sergeant Marshall, regarding a Charlotte County Sheriff's Office employee, Deputy Nicole Kowalski. Sergeant Marshall advised Lt. McDonald that Northport Police Department arrested Deputy Kowalski for battery on a security guard and resisting arrest when she was trespassing inside the new Atlanta Braves Stadium in Northport. Kowalski had entered the secured Atlanta Braves baseball stadium and was running the bases when the security guard, Hunter Glotz, attempted to approach her but she kept walking away from him. Hunter grabbed Kowalski and told her she was not allowed to be in the stadium, at which time Kowalski bit his arm and elbowed his mouth. Northport Police Department arrived on scene commanding Kowalski to stop running. Kowalski ignored the officer's commands until the officer pointed a taser at her, at which time she complied and was handcuffed. Sergeant Marshall stated Kowalski left her mother's residence earlier, March 9, 2022, at 6 p.m. Kowalski's mother resides in Sarasota County Sheriff's Office jurisdiction. Sarasota deputies were looking for her as they were concerned for her well-being. Sergeant Marshall had the mental health unit respond to evaluate Kowalski, and they determined she was not in crisis and did not meet the criteria for a Baker Act. Kowalski was subsequently arrested for trespassing, simple battery with injury and resisting without violence. On March 10, 2022, at first appearance, Judge Charles Roberts found probable cause for Kowalski's arrest. Deputy Kowalski was previously ordered to complete a fit-for-duty evaluation on February 24, 2022, due to an incident that occurred at the training division. Deputy Kowalski refused to do the evaluation. On March 10, 2022, Terry Cochran and Sergeant Nikki Wagner met with Deputy Kowalski at the Sarasota County Jail where Deputy Kowalski was served a notice of intent to withdraw appointment. The intent to withdraw notice provided for the ability for Deputy Kowalski to request a name-clearing hearing by contacting the Sheriff's Administrative Assistant, Jennifer Wireman, no later than 4 p.m. on March 14, 2022, which she did not do. The arrest paperwork and supporting documents are attached to this report. Integrity Professionalism, Trust Page IL Charlotte County Sheriff's Office Notification of Internal Investigation On February 24, 2022, Deputy Kowalski was ordered to complete a fit-for-duty evaluation which she refused. In addition, on March 10, 2022, she was arrested by the Northport Police Department for criminal charges. It was determined that Deputy Kowalski violated the following Charlotte County Sheriff's Office policies and procedures. Charlotte County Sheriff's Office General Order Charlotte County Sheriff's Office Operations Manual General Order 3.50 GO 3.50H.4.A 1. Insubordination offenses failure to comply with orders, compliance with a lawful order of a supervisor or internal affairs investigator. Members of the office will promptly execute the lawful orders and instructions of a supervisor, supervisor member of the sheriff's office, or internal affairs investigator and will not delay or fail to carry out such orders or instructions. GO 3.50H.4.B.3 Violation of official procedures slash directives failure to contact office or be available during administrative leave, members of the office will not ignore or violate official directives, general orders, policies, procedures, orders, or supervisor's instructions, 
or fail to properly execute the duties and responsibilities of their assigned position. GO3.50H.4.C1 Violations of Law Members of the office will adhere to all federal, state, local laws, and ordinances, including but not limited to traffic violations. Documents I obtained the following documents involving Deputy Kowalski, Nordport Police Department reports, CAD printout, and PCA. Sarasota Sheriff's Office Baker Act Report Conclusion Integrity Professionalism, Trust Page 12 Charlotte County Sheriff's Office During this investigation, I reviewed all documents I received and researched regarding the chain of events. I obtained and reviewed the supporting information along with Charlotte County Sheriff's Office General Order 3.50H.4.A.1, the policy governing guidelines for insubordination offenses failure to comply with orders, General Order 3.50H.4.B.3 Violation of official procedures slash directives failure to contact office or be available during administrative leave, and General Order 350H.4.C.1 Violation of law. Based on the information gathered, this investigator finds Charlotte County Sheriff's Office General Order 3.50H.4.A.1 the policy governing guidelines for insubordination offenses failure to comply with orders charges sustained. Deputy Kowalski was ordered on February 24, 2022, to complete a fit-for-duty evaluation, which she refused to do. Based on the information gathered, this investigator finds Charlotte County Sheriff's Office General Order 3.50H.4.B.3 violation of official procedures slash directives failure to contact office or be available during administrative leave charge is sustained. Deputy Kowalski was not at her assigned post, which was her residence during working hours. The Charlotte County Sheriff's Office attempted several times to get in touch with Deputy Kowalski with no avail. Based on the information gathered, this investigator finds Charlotte County Sheriff's Office General Order 3.50H.4.C1 violation of law charge is sustained. On March 10, 2022, Deputy Kowalski was arrested by Northport Police Department for trespassing, simple battery and resisting without violence. Integrity Professionalism, Trust Page 13 Charlotte County Sheriff's Office I the undersigned, do hereby swear, under penalty of perjury, to the best of my knowledge, information, and belief, I have not knowingly or willfully deprived, or allowed another to deprive, the subject of the investigation of any rights contained in SS 112.532 and 112.533, Florida Statutes. Sergeant Nikki Wagner Hashtag 0780 Charlotte County Sheriff's Office Internal Affairs Unit Integrity, Professionalism Title, Sheriff Sheriff Bill Prummel 7474, Utilities Road Punta Gorda, Florida, 33982941-639-2101 CHMFL Copyright NIG can SHGT1 VO Copyright MG Member, Nicole Kowalski Thrategia asterisk PADI Aslan Alifas Rao Ikrusit Conclusion of Facts Investigation, IA Hashtag 2022-015 Name, William Prummel Internal Investigations Allegation No. 1 GO 3.50H.4.A.1 Insubordination Offenses, Outcome, Sustained Allegation No. 2 GO 3.50H.4.B.3 Violation of Official Procedures or Directives Failure to contact office or be available during administrative leave outcome, sustained allegation number 3 UO 3.5011.4.E.1 Violations of law, outcome, sustained allegation number 4, outcome, and slash A allegation number 5, outcome, and slash A. L policy violation L no policy violation. Administrative investigation. Final disposition. Members appointment withdrawn prior to the conclusion of this IA case. C3 hashtag, 2, 11. Signature. IA.599.120618.